truth. Powerful words from basketball superstar LeBron James speaking out after a racist message left in his home. Ahead of tonight's tip-off in Game 1 of the NBA Finals, superstar LeBron James is speaking out about a disturbing off-the-court incident. He delivered a powerful message after his home was vandalized with a racial slur. It's part of a troubling recent wave of race and racist acts across the country. The racism um, will always be a, a part of the world. It's alive every single day. The comments come after his Los Angeles home was vandalized with a racial slur. A police source says the N-word was spray painted on a gate. No one was home at the time, and so far, no one has been arrested. No matter how much money you have, no matter how famous you are, no matter how many people admire you, you know, being black in America is, is tough. A statement that's echoing across the country. For him to speak out, for him not to avoid the issue, for him to look straight into that camera and tell the truth is remarkable. Today, the song We Shall Overcome resonated loudly outside the Museum of African American History and Culture, one day after a noose was discovered inside. Last week, another noose was found hanging from a tree outside Smithsonian's Hirshhorn Museum. Similar incidents have been reported across the country, including a Maryland middle school. The noose symbolizes loss, pain, but your rallying around us helps us remember what a great place we can be when we come together. For James, basketball comes second to being a role model, which is why he's not shying away from what happened. And we got a long way to go, you know, for, for us as a society and for us as African Americans until we, until we feel equal. Powerful words creating a different kind of moment on basketball's biggest stage. Joe Fryer, NBC News, Los Angeles.